this year. Play action on first down, and Franks throws the arm strengths and loops it to the sidelines. It's incomplete. Tried to get the ball to drop some weight over the last year or two. He's much quicker. He's got the ball on second and ten and kind of works his way up the middle for about six. Gaines rush four against the empty backfield, and Franks has time, tries to scramble. Now backpedals, eludes Garvin, but he just got a hand on the quarterback's shoe. And Tony gets a block, and he's a blazer. A dynamic guy, they'll use him all different roles. He's still going. Canarius Tony, they won't catch him. Touchdown, Gators. Handle Marie. Jordan's been a mentor for his younger brother. Now, Tony, the touchdown scorer, gets the handoff on a sweep and spins and is knocked down hard, but got about six on first down. After four games. And Michael Pirine is stacked up. It's going to be third and four. He told me he deleted from his phone the app. Haynes tried to heat up the pocket. He gets the ball out quickly, but being hit immediately right there by Trajan Ooh. Bandy. And they give it to the speech, so the Canes were ready for it, but pure speed. Shot after that. Franks thought about it, now will loop it downfield, and over the head as a flag comes in. And in the backfield, lined up very deep, he's got it on the toss, bobbled it initially, and the Canes penetrate. Flying in there was... Franks just gets it off. Canes bring the pressure. Franks escapes and will take off, and that's 240 pounds headed downhill on third down. Franks is looking that way, fires into traffic, and the catch is made right near the marker by Kyle Pitts. The quarterback keeper is an effective play in this situation, and Franks, although he slips, easily makes the first down. Pirine formation, four receivers to the left, but it's Pirine taking the handoff, bouncing off tackles, and that's been a problem for the Hurricanes defense in the early going. They can't get the Gators to the ground. do in camp to allow you to be a good tackling team. Little tempo, but this time they're ready for Pirine. They meet him behind the line, and Garvin wrestles him down. After and show pressure and bring it on third down. Franks gets it out quickly, and Pirine in the flat as a catch, and a first and goal. And a fumble exchange. Franks and Pirine were confused about who was going to keep it. The Canes say they have it and cut. He's got the handoff, cuts it back into the middle, and fights Harn for about two yards. Maria? Chris, I got to tell you, Miami's. To look at it ahead of time. Davis bobbles the snap. It's on the ground. They're fighting for it. It's a scrum still loose out near midfield. And I think the Gators got it back. Nick Buchanan against the SEC. Gators play action on first down. Franks wants a downfield shot, but now he's chased and has to throw it underneath. It's Pirine with the outlet. They're fortunate to make that play and dodge the of six. 85 yards, a 66-yard touchdown to Tony is the highlight. Pirine dodges traffic in the backfield and falls for a couple of beef. Motions in on third and three. Franks gets blitzed again and a high pass knocked out of the hands. Suddenly find themselves six points down. Franks has time, throws it underneath, and the catch is made by Josh Hammond and the senior slot receiver. Reliable target. Nope. He's set off to the right in single coverage against Bandy. Franks was looking that way. Now fires to Jefferson who made an out cut. And there's and they hand it off to Piran, who can be dangerous on any carry, and he's knocked down out across the 40. Gators do have Games are crowding the line, and they try to get after Franks, but he's well protected, and it's a crossing route. Hammond gets a block, and he will get the first down and get the sideline. 16 penalty. Franks has been pretty sharp tonight, and he's rolling to his right. Here comes the pressure, and they've got him. They've got him at the 40, and no timeout, so the clock is yards. And the short pass, long run to Tony. Other than that play, really not much. They have not been able to press the ball downfield and create... Gaines with a blitz. It's picked up, and Franks loops will throw on the sideline. Easy pitch and catch for a first down. Well, they formation. It's a first down run to Pirine. Pirine in space, and finally wrestled down at midfield. He would expect play action. Franks will take a downfield shot, and he had single coverage on the far side. And now a flag comes in. It was Al Blades. 36 after the timeout.
Yeah, Pirine spinning in traffic is going to be knocked down for a short loss. Uh, physical, but you can see athletic as well. Oh, yeah. So after the loss, they try to get Tony on the end around, and the Canes swarm him, string him out, and drop him for a big loss. ...by the Miami defense. Remember, Tony's got tremendous speed, and when he gets outside, you got to be a wor worried about him. Look at Bandy out here. Now he cuts back, and you got a linebacker right here. So good spacing, good team pursuit by 11 defenders by the Canes. Just great discipline. And Franks fires short, incomplete, never had a chance. Tried to get the ball to Jefferson. He handed off uh, Damian Pierce. And freak. Second and eight. And Pierce deep in the backfield. Fighting forward. Patching on the tack. And it'll be 36 range. Franks zips it. And it's broken up. Coming in to get a hand on that play. Five receiver look. Franks has a lot of time trying to direct traffic downfield, and he delivers a strike to Grimes, and they'll move the stick. That is a rough miss on a crucial play. Now from the pocket, Franks across the middle. Has a man wide open, and the catch is made by Kyle Pitts, the tight end. 6-5 Grimes is a red zone target. He's on the right. Franks looking that way, trying to buy time, and now just fires it out of the end zone. He was chased down there by Gervin Hall in the safe. In the flats, P. Ryan going to make a man miss, but he can't wrestle down by Shaq Quarterman. That's Three years, really the alpha of this defense, matched up in space against P. Ryan. This is a tough ask for a big physical middle linebacker, about 240 pounds. One, but they get it off. Franks, doesn't matter, he's going to be swarmed right at the line of scrimmage, and Diaz and the defense giving them up. Franks on first down. Step up and deliver one of those intermediate throws. Franks into his left, where he's not as comfortable, and the throw is inaccurate to Kyle Pitts. Second and ten. He needs rush four. Franks flushed quickly from the pocket. He gave up on the pocket quickly. Tried to get it to Piron. Inaccurate. Defense and the ability to execute. On third down. You throw across the field to Hammond and the slot receiver battles hard. Shut. They fake it to him. Franks on the edge was looking back to his left and just flips it. Incomplete. A little too close. He ran. Immediately hit in the backfield, but he escapes. Squirts forward for a gain to about the set on third down. Franks across the middle. He Catches it and scores. The Gators go easily out of this game. They can obviously bounce back, but Miami has definitely hit some adversity and responded. And Malik Davis is swarmed in the backfield by Pat Bethel. Rush for Franks. It's over the middle and it's intercepted. Picked off by Amari Carter and the Kane safety still running. And fighting down inside the 25 as a Gator offense presses. To take it to Pirine. Franks looking for a downfield shot. Hammond got it. Josh Hammond dragged down inside the 20. Finally, the Gators. It's on that one. 65 yard gain. Now Pirine in the flat. And he'll be knocked down. That's not field goal to tie it. And they flip it in the flat against the tight end Pitts. And he knifes through and will dive down first and goal, Florida. Didn't look like much of three receivers to the left. Franks keeping it. Barrels in. Touchdown. Florida back on top. On the Gators. Four and a half to bleed out. Up by four. And Franks is thinking about throwing on first down. And it's a pick. A disastrous play. Romeo Finley gets the football back and the Canes.